Are you looking to host a brand new website but don't know which is the best service provider that you need to choose? Or you have already hosted a website but facing a lot of issues? Then this video is for you where I'm going to share the five common mistakes that we do while choosing the hosting service provider. And I'm also going to tell you the best hosting service provider for your needs as well. So again, I have done some of these mistakes. So I thought to share it in the most simple and easy way without talking about technical things. So let's get started and welcome to Sri Ram Benur channel. Now, which are those five things? The first most important one is we don't understand the end goal. Again, we started a website uh, having a particular thing in our mind and we did not plan for the way it is going to scale up, right? You got to really think about how your business is going to scale, right? What is the size that is required? How many uh, people are going to visit your websites? Say, for example, after a month, after six months, after six years, does the existing service provider that you have chosen, do they have that kind of option as well, right? Again, the storage page, whatever you have got. Now, this becomes one of the important thing. Next is the traffic. Are you someone who is going to get the traffic only from your country or you're also going to get audience from your from other countries as well? Is your business global or only specific to your country? Right now that also matters the most. Why? Because if you're going to have your business global, then you got to choose a service provider who can provide great speed all over the world as well. Next, the impact of downtime. Now, say, for example, your website was down for maybe a couple of minutes or a couple of hours. What is the impact that is going to lead for you? If you're someone who is just having a blogging website, it might not create so much of issues. But if you are somebody who has a small business, you have an e-commerce website. Now you are an author, coach or a trainer who is also trying to sell your products and service on the website. Then downtime during the peak hours would certainly impact your revenue as well. So that becomes really important for you to choose the right hosting service provider as well. Now that's the first most important one. Now let's understand the second one. Falling for unrealistic price. Again, most of the hosting service providers, they give great deal when you subscribe for their uh, hosting services, right? Again, uh, you end up getting a great discount from most of them. But you need to see, is it only the initial low pricing? What about the renewal pricing? How high it is going to be, right? If you see that, okay, the renewal cost is going to be too high, then you got to think in the beginning, not like after a year where you see that, okay, oh my God, suddenly my bill has increased, right? So please do check that. So consider long-term cost. What is the long-term investment that is going to be for maintaining your website in the right way? So always consider the realistic pricing as well. Just don't rely on the discount that you get for the first time. Next, ignoring the uptime guaranteed. Now, what is the impact of this? If your website is down for some time, right? And it happens multiple times. In that case, your SEO ranking would be low. So that means Google ranking, uh, especially for the websites which are uh, having frequent downtime, they're not going to have a great score and it might not come in the top search as well. So that's one important factor. Again, uh, if it is a blogging website, then there might not be so much of issues for you. But if it's an e-commerce website where you're selling products and services, a downtime during the peak time where you're going to have a lot of sales could be the major revenue loss for you. In fact, uh, I have faced something like that where I was gener I was about to generate roughly about 1.5 lakh or something as a revenue. And that's when I had major issues with my site because of which I lost a lot of revenue. That could happen with many of us as well if we are not having the right site as well, right hosting service provider as well. So the best or the preferred uh, uptime is 99.9%. That's the minimum that you should be looking whenever you're going to go for the hosting service provider okay so with that let's move to the next one ignoring the scalability options now you feel that okay your business is going to grow massive in the upcoming times so you need to see how easy it is right if not you'll invest a lot of time and money in uh, setting up those things in fact i still remember initially i had my uh, hosting on a different uh, service provider i didn't have the option to scale it up now because of that i was losing time and second is my website had become really slow. Now, again, that led to a lot of people uh, not accessing my website because it was taking a lot of time for loading and I lost business as well, right? 
now the loss in business was in lakhs so if i had planned it much earlier i could have invested in a better service provider as well right so again uh, that's something that you got to consider second is ease of scaling the resources now you see that okay your business is going to grow rapid and uh, you want to scale up the ram and things like that how easy is it for you to do so please consider something where you can easily scale the resources as, as well coming to the last one neglecting the customer support again uh, in the last 2 3 years i have go, i have tried and tested multiple service providers there have been some of the service providers who say that okay uh, we'll ask our technical team to check on this and they will help you right there are some of the service providers who say let me help you to fix this issue right now you got to really understand who is going to provide the best service so that your website is always up and running okay so responsive and knowledgeable team if the team does not have the right knowledge who is there as the customer support then it is going to be an issue for you so check also uh, what kind of support they give live chat email phone support right if they have all the three then that's the best you could have now coming to the next most important thing best hosting service provider based on your needs if you're somebody who is a beginner or a blogger then there are different set of hosting service providers that are there if you're somebody who is a business who is having your own uh, business and you have your e-commerce website or you are a trainer and a coach where you have listed your uh, products where you are going to sell them then there is a different hosting service provider for that as well now coming to beginners and bloggers after doing a lot of research the two best ones that i have found is hosting era and days to hosting i'm going to talk about the pricing and also features of that now coming to small business or e-commerce websites then cloudways is something that is really amazing which comes with a lot of security features uh, where you can also scale it up whenever you need right so let's talk about all the pricings and then you can decide which is the best one that you want to go for again i have given all the links in the video description you can just click on that and sign up as well so first let's understand about hosting it again there are a lot of things that i want to share here let's directly jump in and understand from their website itself now coming to if you want to get your uh, domain name certainly you can get from uh, name cheap again i have given the link below in the video description hosting it the price starts from as low as 69 rupees per month now this is for hosting a single website but again the recommended one that i would say here is the plan that comes with 249 rupees okay so if you see with this you can host only one website okay always go for something where you can host multiple websites so tomorrow you feel that okay no you want to host maybe second website or third website always go with something where you can host multiple websites as well and the price that starts for hosting multiple websites is 139 rupees per month and please check this the renewal price is going to be 249 rupees per month with most of the sites it is going to be like this now again i don't see a major or very high difference here but yes this is going to be the price the best one that i see from hostinger is the plan that comes with 249 and the renewal price is going to be 499 rupees per month now what is the advantage of this let's understand so increased uh, performance up to 5x now this plan comes with 200 gb of storage which is really good daily backups are also included now say for example you made some changes to your website and suddenly your website crashed there are daily backups available so you can just restore to the previous one it also helps you to get free emails unlimited free ssl certificate which is good unlimited bandwidth okay you also get a free domain worth 799 rupees for one year again please check this is for one year okay so if you click on this it says for one year only okay so 12 months and again free ssl uh, again this is uh, unlimited okay now free email up to 100 uh, custom email ids is what you get for free and coming to uptime it's 99.9% uptime with 24 bar 7 customer support and this is usually via chat support okay they have uh, 24 bar 7 live chat support available now this is the pricing of hostinger if i just come back and explain here about uh, hostinger this is great for wordpress it is affordable free domain name for an year free email up to 100 emails uptime is 99.9% free ssl certificate chat support support that is there for 24 bar 7 they also have the staging website now say for example uh, you want to make some changes to your website but you don't want to directly do it in the live website so they have something called a staging website where you can first make the changes and then push it to your live website as well 
now this is there only in the business plan that is there okay again good support the recommended plan is starting from 249 rupees per month renewal price is 499 but again it's up to you if you want to say for example you just want to try out in that case you can even go for single but i don't recommend going for single single at least go for premium but please note that your speed may not be so great it's a standard performance it is not going to be loading very fast and things like that okay that's what you can expect from this now coming to e2 hosting details this is great for wordpress uh, affordable but slightly bit more expensive compared to hostinger the startup plan starts at 2.99 dollars that's roughly about three dollars so three dollars is roughly about uh, about 250 rupees or something like that per month okay now that can have only one website website so let's talk about something which comes with multiple website hosting as well now if you go with 599 dollars per month plan they have unlimited websites okay they also have unlimited ssd storage ssd storage is something that is really good for faster uh, page load and everything okay and again if you look at the uh, key features it comes with the 24 bar 7 phone live chat and email support with 99.9 percent uptime free ssl certificate okay so these are all the main things that are included here they also have something called as turbo servers plus more power which is at 6.99 dollars per month when you go for renewal the price is going to be higher now here they say up to 20x faster so here your websites can be much faster uh, loading as well i'm going to quickly talk about the renewal price here if you're going to renew the turbo boost uh, web hosting it is going to be 263 dollars per year okay but the only thing with uh, a2 hosting here is you get unlimited websites and unlimited storage as well okay so that's something to consider you don't get free domain name which you get with uh, hostinger see again you go to check that you get only for the first year so that's about 799 subsequent years you don't get that uh, free domain you have to again certainly pay money for that as well again good support uptime is 99.9 percent .9 free ssl certificate they also have the website staging or staging website turbo servers which can certainly give high performance uh, loading as well support phone email live chat as well okay based on the recommended plan it is about uh, six point nine nine dollars per month okay that comes to about 580 rupees per month but the renewal price is going to be about uh, 22 dollars now this is when i'm recording this video okay 1826 okay that's the approximate investment that you're going to have when you want to do it okay so again they have different plans you can certainly check that as well now coming to small business if you're a small business or uh, a trainer or somebody who has your products listed then cloudbase is good this is good for e-commerce and coaches as i said uh, it has enterprise grade security that means you can be assured that okay it is not going to be easy for hackers to hack your website there's a lot more security features that they have uptime almost 99.9 percent uh, uptime is there again you get a dedicated servers which is really good having the dedicated server uh, where you also have the option to easily scale up now say for example tomorrow you feel that okay uh, your uh, visits to the website is going to increase certainly there are options where the ram size can be increased accordingly okay the only drawback with this is you don't get the uh, free emails but again there are other ways to get uh, email uh, accounts as well okay uh, certainly you might have to pay a little bit uh, extra for that but yes no free emails are included with cloudbase it has auto heal facility that means if there is some issue with the server that is going to happen uh, there is an auto heal which can immediately restore your uh, site without you having any downtime right so that means they can ensure uninterrupted service for your website speed is great and the price starts from 14 dollars per month let me just quickly take you to the cloudways again all the links i have given right below the, uh, in the video description you can just click on that and get as well so features 24 bar 7 support free ssl certificate is going to be given free migration unlimited applications so you can host any number of applications you want uh, dedicated firewalls so for higher security 24 bar 7 real time monitoring automated backups are there staging environment is there right so auto heal is there so a lot of 
features that can really protect your site okay which is really needed for e-commerce sites as well so uh, again uh, coming to the plans in fact just to give you an idea uh, i migrated from the service pro other service providers to cloudways so that i can get the security features and also most uh, reliable uh, hosting as well without any issues again if you are a beginner or if you want to try out the other two are really good so coming to the plan if you are going to look for uh, 1 gb ram say for example you can start with this and if you see that okay your website is performing optimally well uh, based on the traffic it is getting right or the number of hits that are happening in the site you can stay on this plan uh, which is going to be $14 per month okay so that's the pricing per month now if you want to say for example your uh, traffic and the number of visits have drastically increased certainly you can upgrade to 2 GB which is going to be $28 per month you can upgrade to 4 GB depending upon whatever uh, how your business is growing you can certainly easily scale it up as well in fact they also have the feature where uh, they have auto scaling uh, options as well truly auto scaling and fully managed WordPress hosting so you can certainly check that as well again this is something that is very reliable for e-commerce and e-commerce websites and uh, especially for those small business and uh, coaches who are listing your products and services so well that's the details about the hosting now again comparing to the price here right so if you talk about $14 per month the starting plan so $14 is like uh, 1,000 yeah about 1200 rupees per month is going to be the investment if you're going to go with cloudways however uh, if you're going to go with uh, a2 hosting and if you're going to host a e-commerce or uh, e-commerce website or something like that in that case you could see the price is going to be slightly higher as well but here you have easy scaling option as well okay so these are all the three top hosting service providers which are very reliable with great security features as well again based on your needs you can certainly sign up for any of them that you want links have been given in the video description thanks for watching if this video was informative and easy for you to understand please give a like and again if you are not already subscribed please do subscribe as well if you have any questions related to this topic just comment below i'll be more than happy to answer you can click on this end screen to watch more videos on how you can generate income from different uh, platforms as well i'm shriram benur i'm going to see you in the next video Till then, take care and bye for now.